What's up, my Moon Tribe? I'm Haley, and welcome back to Moon Tribe Tarot. These are general messages only, which means to take or resonate and leave behind what does not. If you'd like to book a personal reading, you can find all the information in the link down below on how to reach me. Let's get right up into it. Two cards for what you need to know, one card of advice. From February 25th to the 29th, we got the King of Wands, the Queen of Wands, and the Magician as advice. I will have you know that the Two of Swords also came out together, so I'm going to read that slightly offhand. So, the King of Wands and the Queen of Wands... Usually, I would say that this is a gender bender deck, but since they came out together, it represents a literal power couple. They don't have to, you don't have to be um, a fire sign for this to be in your chart, but it's incredibly passionate. It would, for a lot of you, I would su strongly suggest that if you don't have energy in your chart somewhere, you are still exhibiting these behaviors. The king and queen of wands would exhibit in incredible passion. They'd make in incredibly good parents, very sexual, very sexually orientated. Um, they would love passion. They could get bored easily. They would have a lot that they would like to do and see and get done. They would have a, a very strong leadership roles. They'd be good in a, uh, a working environment. They would be the leaders of their domain. They are both breadwinners. And having them to come out together would indicate that they are a power couple. So for you, for your star sign, um, this is having a power couple with somebody with having all the potential and purpose to make this the way that it should be. This is incredibly good, good spread. They are paired together, which means that they are working together. Um, the magician represents the beginning of anything, or it's the potential to have any outcome to any situation, uh, being that you are the alchemist, so you could w wield this in any way. The Let me read you what the magician means. Can't ever fucking get there. Okay. You have the skills you need to accomplish your goal. Be bold and confident. Be willing to step outside your comfort zone and do something different. The situation calls for magic, which you can create. Do the thing, stand back, and be prepared to be amazed. So you, I feel like you have a choice to make with the situation between a power couple, you and this power couple. It's, this is a relationship choice, I feel, um, because they were powered together, they are partnered. The two of swords represents a stalemate choice, so it's kind of like you don't, everything here kind of, it, it, it's not that everything here looks I was going to say the Two of Wands. It's not the Two of Wands. The Two of Swords represents a stalemate decision that needs to be broken. And right now, you don't really have a lot of other ideas on how to break it. So I get this as a, as a um, maybe being afraid to commit to something or having to make a decision in this partnership that goes somewhere practical, that, that that goes somewhere planned, that goes somewhere with all the potential. This is, I feel like even though they are so strong, of their, they're both of their higher mind selves, I feel like this is a new beginning. I feel like the time from the 25th to the 29th is going to be a prosperous time, but it's also one that there needs to be a choice between a partnership that has to be made. Are you saying that this could go any way? That this has the full potential to go the best that it possibly could for the star sign of... <laughs> what the fuck up is Taurus? What the fuck is up, Taurus? Right off the bat, we got the first one doing good shit. I'll see you on the flip side.